Hey everyone, we are doing kind of a mini adventure today. One of our favorite coffee places that's local called Hay Bear Cafe. It's a boba tea place. So technically it's not a coffee place. I just always order coffee there. But it's called Boba Tea Cafe or Hay Bear Cafe and it serves boba tea. And we're going to go and do a pickup order and pick up some drinks and maybe just like do some driving around because it's Memorial Day and we don't want to be like at home all day because it's a special day and we don't have school this summer so we're gonna go and pick that up and maybe do like some just driving around we might you know do a nature trail or something I don't know it's just the girls and me this time but we're gonna go and pick up drinks here is their menu you have to select curbside pickup right now because their dining room is not open I usually get this one coffee drink but it's like a specialty thing you order the number so I've actually never ordered it by what it's called so I'll have to go and see if I can actually find it or I may they have this new specialty drink right now called the uh, Hawaiian black tea it has pineapple and lemon and you can also order it with blueberries on top so I may look at that and they have a whole kids menu with no added sugars you can get one free topping with it and if your kids are like a couple of mine and they don't like the boba pearls you can actually order different toppings with it um, this one looks really good for like Sarah it's lactose free milk so that would be something cool for her that's lactose free and still has milk in it um, here's the kids ones the toppings and I don't remember what all the toppings are, but I think like they can get like these things that you, they're kind of like the boba pearls, but they're not, but like they bite into them and then they get fruit blast flavors with them. So the honey lemon is really good. I've tried that one of theirs. The tropical bear is really good. So I'm going to let them pick before we go. And then we have an order pickup time. It's not like super close for us. It's like over an hour away, but it's so worth it. We arrived a little bit early, so it's not quite ready yet, but that's okay. I had booked a little bit farther out than it would take us to drive here in case we had any traffic issues or congestion or anything like that. They are currently working on, we live in the greater Knoxville area, they're currently working on I-40 right now. There's a little bit of construction traffic with that. The cool thing is, if you can see behind us, they actually have food trucks almost every day possibly every day but at least almost every other day or every day on their social media like on their instagram and all that you can find all the information of when food trucks will arrive if you can see behind me i don't want to put people on camera without asking them their employees are wearing masks and gloves to deliver the curbside pickup is every other parking space so it's really cool that we can come and we can come and pick up like our favorite drinks and the caffeinated drinks and all that with the food trucks here if we wanted to order from them so it's really cool to have this and i'm really glad to finally get to come back because like i said this is my favorite drink place to come to when it's open in the back they have a playground and on the inside there's an indoor play area for kiddos and there's also like a small room where you could do like private meetings and things it's just a really nice place and it's like a little almost hole in the wall kind of place in Knoxville to come but if you're ever in the Knoxville area and it's right off of I-40 between the Cedar Bluff and the Gallagher View exits it's really good you can customize the drinks however you want so we're currently waiting on ours but we also order like five drinks at a time so as soon as it's ready though I will show you our drinks what we ordered and I may try the new one on camera I kind of weird about trying food on camera but I may try the new one on camera I saw it advertised after our last trip here and really want to try it so we're gonna give it a shot and I think each of the kids all order different drinks as well right mm -hmm. did you all order different drinks mm -hmm. 
yeah they all order different drinks this is the first time that we've ordered any of the milk drinks for the kids they asked for milk drinks this time so we're going to check those out they're lactose free milk drinks which for this one is perfect so we're going to try that out and then we may hit up like a walking trail here in a little bit so here's how they arrive they each have their own individual bags i'm going to divvy them up and see who has what flavor this one is the tropical bear slush did you get boba in here yes and with boba at the bottom this one's madeline's she still orders the kid size because look how big this kid i mean that's my hand holding this kid size cup so she still orders kid size with hers so this is dad's it's the cafe almond made with almond milk it has less ice it's cold coffee regular sugar large size boba with milk foam and he also has an espresso shot in here so we're going to take this home to him this is rebecca's it's the choco bear kids one she also ordered you ordered strawberry pop with, pop with your choco one yeah okay just checking so she ordered strawberry pops with hers that's the strawberry pops in the bottom and they all come with these huge boba straws so this is the first time we've tried the milk, the lactose free milk flavored one. Sarah, who is super happy that they have a lactose free option, has the, it says berry milk, but on the website it actually says strawberry milk, and then she has blueberry pops at the bottom of hers. Last but not least, I have the Hawaii black tea, half sugar, cold tea, less ice with blueberry and boba in here. I heard it was amazing with the blueberry, so I wanna try it. I'm actually gonna shake mine. A little bit you can shake them the way they seal these you can actually shake these up before you drink them so I'm actually gonna shake mine up a little bit and try it for the first Stick it in. what do you think it's good it's good yours is a reorder right mm. you've ordered that one before so it's a reorder right yours are new you have the milk ones or the lactose free ones what do you think Sarah mm, I think I haven't had strawberry milk in a really long time. I can't remember the last time I had the Is it good? Yes. What do you think? Good. I can't get my straw in. This new Hawaii tea that they have with the fruit in it. And yes, definitely order it with the blueberry adding additive. It's so worth it. Definitely worth it. Love it.